The refraction property is talking about the tangent at P. That's a tangent at P will be equal inclined to the focal chord through P. This is two focal chords through P. And the angle between this and that, they will be equal. So that's the refraction property. So how do we prove these questions? So we're starting from question one. So question one is proving PS over PR PS over PR is equal to cos beta, E cos beta. So how do we prove it? Okay, let's do it. So, so we know PS over P N is equal to E. This is by the definition of ellipse. That's about the definition of the ellipse. So we know that everyone knows this. That's the definitions. And then by using this, we can change to PS is actually equal to EPM. EPM. So therefore, PS over PR is equal to EPN over PR. And then we know in the right angle triangle, P and R in that, we have cos beta is equals to P N over P R in this right angle triangle, P and R. P and R, that's right angle triangle here. We have cos beta equal to adjacent over hypotenuse, right? Yes, okay. So then we continue. So therefore, PS over PR will be equals to E times cos beta. That's it. First question finished. And then second questions. So second question is ask you to proving PS dash over PW. Okay, let's say PS dash over PW is PS dash this one over PW. We're using this ratio to show this angle equals to this angle now. So let's continue. So we can use in the similar ideas. So PS dash over PW will be equal to E P M over PW which also equal to E cos beta. So therefore, PS over PR is equals to PS dash over PW. So then we back to the question here. We know PS over PR, which is this one, PS over PR, that's actually equal to cos this angle, because this is the right angle. And then PS dash over PW is actually equal to cos this angle, because this is the right angle. So then by using this sentence here, we can say therefore, angle RPS is equal to angle WPS dash. 
proved. Therefore, we proved the refraction property.